Welcome back to Dinar Guru. I'm Sophia, and I'm thrilled to bring you the latest updates on Iraq's economic progress. Before we dive in, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Give us a like, and let us know your thoughts in the comments. The news from Iraq keeps getting better and better, and it's exactly what we want to hear. It's fantastic to see the country moving forward with its reforms and striving to enhance the quality of life for its people. But are you starting to feel like the good news is becoming routine? It seems like every day there's another positive development, almost to the point where it's becoming second nature. Expectations are at an all-time high as we continue to hear incredible updates. Stay tuned as we continue to follow these exciting developments. Thanks for watching, and let's hope for some great news very soon. Welcome to Dinar Guru. As we stand on the precipice of what could be a transformative period for Iraq, the good news just keeps coming. The country's ongoing commitment to reforms and improvements in quality of life is not only heartening but also indicative of a profound shift in the region's economic and political landscape. It's almost becoming a daily occurrence to hear about Iraq's advancements, so much so that one might wonder if we're starting to take these positive developments for granted. But what's behind this relentless stream of optimism? Let's dive into the recent updates and explore the implications for Iraq's future. Reforms and quality of life. A commitment to progress. Iraq's path to recovery and growth has been marked by significant reforms aimed at stabilizing the country and enhancing the well-being of its citizens. The government's dedication to these reforms is evident in the numerous initiatives undertaken to address long-standing issues. From infrastructure improvements to economic policies designed to stimulate growth, the changes are far-reaching. One of the most encouraging aspects is the focus on enhancing the quality of life for ordinary Iraqis. This involves efforts to improve healthcare, education, and public services. By addressing these fundamental needs, the Iraqi government is laying a solid foundation for sustained development. The commitment to these reforms signals a shift from reactive measures to proactive strategies aimed at creating lasting positive change. A pervasive sense of optimism. In recent times, the frequency and consistency of good news coming out of Iraq have been almost overwhelming. The country's progress is being reported so often that it risks becoming background noise. However, this shouldn't detract from the significance of these developments. The optimism surrounding Iraq's future is not just a fleeting sentiment but a reflection of tangible progress. The expectations surrounding Iraq's economic reform, particularly in relation to the Iraqi dinar and its potential revaluation, is at an all-time high. This is driven by the substantial improvements in various sectors and the increasing confidence in the government's ability to execute its plans effectively. Breaking down the latest developments. The Kurdish region's role. Recent news from the Kurdish region has been particularly positive. The resolution of the crisis with the Wisdom Party is a significant milestone. This development is crucial as it affects the broader political landscape and the implementation of key agreements, including the hydrocarbon law. The HCL has been a central point of contention and discussion in Iraq's efforts to achieve comprehensive economic reform. The agreement and implementation of the HCL are seen as critical steps in stabilizing the oil sector and ensuring equitable distribution of oil revenues. The Kurdish government's resolution of the crisis with wisdom and its subsequent discussions with Baghdad mark a significant move toward finalizing the HCL. Expectations and Timelines the anticipation that Baghdad will soon rubber stamp the HCL has led to heightened expectations. The timeline for this process is reportedly set between now and August 5th. This is a pivotal moment, as the completion of the HCL is closely tied to the potential revaluation of the Iraqi dinar. Historically, there has been a pattern where the finalization of the HCL is followed by an RV. This expectation has led to considerable speculation and optimism about the imminent RV of the Iraqi dinar. The positive chatter within the Iraqi banking sector further fuels this anticipation, with many hoping that the revaluation could happen within the stated time frame. The implications of a potential RV. A revaluation of the Iraqi dinar would have profound implications for the country's economy. It could serve as a catalyst for increased investor confidence, economic stability, and improved financial conditions for the Iraqi people. The potential RV is seen as a critical step in Iraq's journey toward economic recovery and growth. For those following the developments closely, the hope is that the revaluation could happen even sooner than anticipated. 
While the exact timing remains uncertain, the ongoing positive developments provide a strong basis for optimism. Maintaining perspective amidst the optimism. As the news continues to pour in, it's essential to maintain perspective. While the steady stream of good news can sometimes feel overwhelming, it's crucial to recognize the significance of each development. The ongoing reforms, the resolution of key issues like the HCL, and the potential for an RV are all part of a broader narrative of positive change. The challenge for many is balancing excitement with patience. The road to recovery and growth is often fraught with challenges, and while the current momentum is promising, it's important to stay informed and grounded. Looking ahead, the future looks promising for Iraq, with a series of positive developments creating a sense of hope and anticipation. The focus on reforms and improving the quality of life, coupled with the resolution of key issues like the HCL, positions the country well for continued progress. As we await the finalization of these developments and the potential revaluation of the dinar, it's a time for cautious optimism. The good news is indeed exciting, but it's also a reminder of the ongoing journey and the work still needed to achieve long-term stability and prosperity. In the end I will request my friends who are watching me let's be positive and patient because patience is the key to success. Please subscribe my channel and support me you guys have a great day. Thank you.